uh, Teen Wolf minigame. <laughs> I mean, Teen Wolf Sports is where it starts. It because you've got your basketball game and you've got your boxing game. Yeah. Oh. Is it one Teen Wolf or is it a bunch of Teen Wolves? I mean, I guess you'd have to feature multiple Teen Wolves because one Teen well, Wolf I think, would just win. I think people like the, the, tutor- the, time. the tutorial intro levels, you've got to be... Oh, I mean, the, okay, the premise of these movies is you can't unleash the wolf. Yeah. And and, and there's got to be some sort of advantage to not turning into the into the wolf, but, but it's okay at certain instances. I don't know if you want get, to yeah. get that deep. Or... Or it's basically like the tutorial and first few levels are you're the only wolf and you're just dominating the humans. And then the later yeah. levels, you actually fight other other team wolves. Now, now what if – now, people may – I mean, wolves are cool, but what if we introduce some more mythological creatures into it? Okay. Like maybe a teen mummy or like a, like a teen zombie or like um, – a teen uh, creature from the Black Lagoon, Teen Kong. Teen Kong <laughs> comes rolling in. They all have their own strengths. and we. I mean, because I, I remember wanted... the Teen Wolf cartoon, I mean, a lot of the times they <laughs> families full of supernatural Other... creatures. I remember there was like wizards and, and yeah. I guess I was picturing it though, if you start it off with that you're the only supernatural character. And like I want it to look like a... You know the the Connect Sports game, like look kind of realistic, or well, not realistic, but like look like they're taking it seriously. And then you unlock all the silliness. Like I don't even want to be sold on it. I just want that to be like Easter egg stuff that all of a sudden you're fighting all these creatures. Because I don't know if it, I feel like if you sell it with with the creatures in mind, it becomes like this much more kiddie game. And I, for some reason, yeah. I want this game to be overly serious. <laughs> and you know, we what, what we've done is we what, what Ken Levine comes in and. He's going to take the Teen Wolf franchise to the next level. <laughs> I don't know what the Ken it's Levine... It's going to be ultra-violent, but it's going to have a meaning. The uh, Ken Levine play. Teen Wolf Sports Arena DLC. I don't know what that looks like. <laughs> dystopian oh, dystopian sports games featuring werewolves. Dystopian Teen Wolf? <laughs> teen Wolf in, in the sky. Okay, yeah, let's just drop the, the sports thing. How... Maybe that can be Ken's next what, project. What kind we, of games can we get Teen Wolf into? Uh, <laughs> Ken, look, you know, Bioshock Infinite, it was great. We loved it, but we got this project for you that you're going to love it. You remember Teen Wolf? Go. And with your name attached to it, we think we can get Michael J. Fox to come back and do the voices. <laughs> Mike, yeah.